Hello and Happy New Year. My name is Jason Mercer. I'm TREB's Director of Market Analysis and Service Channels. I'm going to take the next few minutes to provide an overview of the residential real estate market in the GTA for calendar year 2016, insofar as transactions through TREB's MLS system are concerned. So my overview will be against the backdrop of overarching economic trends and policy decisions. Greater Toronto Area Realtors reported a record 113,133 home sales through TREB's MLS system, up by 11.8% compared to 2015. The calendar year 2016 result included 5,338 sales in December, an annual increase of 8.6%. Now the strongest annual rate of sales growth in 2016 was experienced for condominium apartments, followed by detached homes. A relatively strong regional economy, low unemployment, and very low borrowing costs kept the demand for ownership housing strong in the GTA as the region's population continued to grow in 2016. Now it's important to point out that the strong demand that we experienced in 2016 was very much domestic in nature. TREP recently commissioned Ipsos to survey its members with regard to the level and type of foreign buying activity within the Greater Toronto Area. The results of the IPSO survey show that the level of foreign buying activity is low in the GTA. Only an estimated 4.9% of GTA transactions in which TREB members acted on behalf of a buyer involved a foreign purchaser. In the City of Toronto, the share of foreign buyers was 5%. TREB will be releasing the full results of the IPSO survey dealing with foreign buyers on January 31, 2017 in conjunction with its market year in review and outlook report and related media event. Turning to price, the annual rate of growth for the MLS Home Price Index in the TREB market area accelerated throughout 2016, from 10.7% in January to 21% in December. The overall average selling price for calendar year 2016 was $729,922 up 17.3% compared to 2015. The pace of annual growth for the average selling price also picked up throughout the year, including an increase of 20% in December. The annual rate of price growth increased throughout much of 2016 as the supply of listings remained very constrained. Active listings at the end of December were at their lowest point in a decade and a half. Total new listings for 2016 were down by almost 4%. In 2016, we saw policy changes and policy debates pointed at the demand side of the market. If we want to see a sustained moderation in the pace of price growth, what we really need is more policy focus on issues impacting the lack of homes available for sale. TREB's market year in review and outlook report and media event will include an expert panel and related submissions on the foundations of the housing supply issue in the GTA and possible solutions. With continued strong rates of price growth, housing affordability is a growing concern. Unfortunately, the City of Toronto's Budget Committee is considering an increase to the land transfer tax that could see buyers of average price homes pay another $750 to the City, which would represent a 7% increase to the $11,000 that they already pay City Hall as an upfront land transfer tax closing cost. This would be on top of the $12,000 that is also paid to the province. First-time buyers can end up paying $475 more or at best be no better off, even though the province recently doubled their first-time buyer LTT rebate. The last thing people need is to pay another $750 on top of the $11,000 that they already pay to City Hall. The City should be looking for ways to make housing affordability better, not worse, especially for first-time buyers who could go backwards or at best be no better off. It is TREB's opinion that the City's Budget Committee should stop this proposal in its tracks and instead enhance the rebate for first-time buyers. The persistent supply issue in the GTA and various government policy proposals impacting the housing market will remain top of mind as we move through 2017. With this in mind, I look forward to speaking with you again at the beginning of February. Thanks very much. Brought to you by GTA Realtors.